Hi guys, Nilo from Multic. Uh, this video we're going to do in English because it's an unboxing and a small review of a SA made product and um, they also ship it overseas. Uh, hopefully this video gets a lot of likes and a lot of views. Without further ado, it's the APW Carbon X chassis. Now guys, I'm very stoked to open this. Uh, I received it today, so um, let's see what's what's cooking. Boxing and packaging perfect as always. Very neatly done. <laughs> Uh, and upon first view, just have a look at that. Freaking hell, this thing is spectacular actually. Um, let's see, we've got a small packet of screws, I presume it's the action screws and some accessory screws. Some long slot here. Comes with a Arca rail with a small Picatinny in the front and a sling a hole for your where you can put your, your carry sling through. Let's take this baby out. Okay guys, so this chassis is spectacular. Uh, the workmanship on this is out of this world. The finish is so freaking smooth. Uh, on the handle, on your your uh, grip, there's nice thumb rests, ambidextrous thumb rests, and the finishing is very smooth. It's it's a high quality chassis. Uh, let me tell you. It's got the aluminium insert for your action. Nice barricade stop built into the uh, magazine well. Uh, they do have internal weights available as well. We have sets of that. Um, then your Arca rail will go at the bottom. I think in this package, yes, there is a sling swivel that that you can fit in the back here. You've got your height adjustment for your cheek riser. Very nice. It's got little indexes on it. So if you you can hear it click. It's freaking awesome. And then you can also do your length of pull with uh, removing spaces or adding additional spaces. It doesn't come with additional spaces, but I'm sure we can order you some. Uh, they even went as far as designing their own butt pad, branded butt pad. It's freaking awesome. Uh, the finish, as I said, it's it's really, really, really good. It's smooth. This is the FTE version. It's for Tika short action. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to throw a barreled action into this. We're going to do a little 308 20 inch. Uh, that's the, the gun that I use for my NRL Hunter and my actual hunting gun. So, but before we do that, let's get a scale and weigh this puppy. Okay guys, we've got a scale here. Let's do some weighing. So it's 1,630 grams, it's, it's light enough. <laughs> um, with different inserts and different actions, you will definitely get a weight difference. So I don't know which ones will be heavier and which ones will be lighter, but 1.6 kgs um, for me, for a walk and stalk gun, is more than light enough. I've been walking and stalking with a actual chassis on my gun, so um, this carbon fiber chassis will be a massive, massive upgrade. 
we will be able to supply you guys with these chassis uh, we we don't keep chassis in stock because there's too many actions and too many variables in color and all that kind of stuff so we do supply them on order we will also be able to supply you with internal weights external weights and um, yeah guys we're gonna go out to the range we're gonna fit a barrel action to it quickly and then uh, I think we'll go tomorrow we'll go to the range and then we will uh, test this puppy out and we'll give you a report on the recoil management the stability and all that kind of stuff uh, I'm very excited to see what this chassis is capable of okay guys so yeah we've got it fitted bipod on barreled action in range time okay hi guys so we're out on the range here uh, we fitted a Tika 308 Winchester in this carbon X chassis from APW and um, we're here to test it we did the unboxing for you guys let's see how it performs so what we're gonna do is I'm just gonna check my zero at 100 meters and then we're gonna go and see if we can plink some steel at distance this is my NRL hunter rifle this is also the rifle that I use to hunt um, I'm a strong believer in using the same rifle for NRL hunter than you hunt with it's why the sport was developed so I only have this one rifle that I do my hunting and NRL hunter competitions with so let's test this Guys, I'm impressed. I'm impressed with the recoil management of this chassis. Uh, for the weight, it's only 1.6 kgs. Um, the recoil is, is definitely not bad. It's very manageable. Uh, you also get internal weights for this chassis and external weights from APW that you can fit on it. Um, I do have internal weights and I do exter and I do have uh, external weights. I will fit them uh, to just test it, but this is my walk and stalk gun, so I don't want to uh, make it too heavy. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead. I am zeroed now, so I'm gonna go ahead and um, just zero my turret caps here, and then I'm gonna do a grouping at 100 meters then I'll take you guys to the 100 meters and we'll see what it does and um, then we can go out to distance a little bit Okay guys, sorry I, I had to remove my glasses, it's so freaking hot out here today, 
that um, my lenses kept on fogging up and I couldn't see where I'm shooting so um, we're just walking over to the 100 meter uh, target and then I'll show you the grouping that we got of course there will always be one out of a five shot group that you pull and uh, as Murphy wants it it will be the one that I've got on video so let's go and check it out okay guys so there's four shots four shots and there's the one that I pulled um, of course there will be one that you pull always uh, and yeah it's on video now I'm very 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 happy with that so uh, I'm very happy with this chassis so let's uh, let's see if we can eat some still at distance see you back at the bench okay so we're back at the bench I'm happy with that grouping at 100 meters. I'm very angry with myself for pulling that one shot. Uh, but that's Murphy's Law for you. Uh, it's freaking hot out here today. Uh, the sun is in my eyes. Um, I'm, I'm getting very, very, very hot at the moment. Uh, we've got on this range from Multec, uh, we've got 700 meters available to us. Uh, this is the range where I do all the low development. So I'm feeling... I'm feeling lucky. I'm going to try and eat the 700 meter from the go and then uh, hopefully we can get a first round hit. Uh, Mirage is crazy but uh, the trusty, trusty 308 is here with us. So we're going to take our another trusty instrument, our Kestrel and we're just going to go to 700 meters. There's no wind, absolutely no wind. Uh, but the Mirage is going to be a killer. Um, so let's just do that. And I'm going to go point four mils for, for the Mirage. So Mac is loaded up with five rounds. Let's see what we can do. Hopefully, hopefully we'll get the first round hit. Make sure we level. I didn't even see that impact. That's how bad the mirage is. Let's see what we can do. No dice. Oh, impact, great stuff man, great stuff, I think we are a little bit high. Impact. Impact. And be empty. Oh, let's just single feet. This is fun now. Impact. And one last one. And impact. 
right in the center so guys I can definitely recommend this chassis give us a call uh, we won't have it on our website because we only have uh, items that we stock on our website so give me a call we can definitely sort you out with a chassis like this and uh, you won't be disappointed the workmanship on this chassis is phenomenal so see you guys again cheers